When the ruling All Progressives Congress jettisoned the idea of continuity in leadership and opt for national elective convention, there was a lot of concern on the possibility of violent free convention due to the crisis experienced at the party's ward, local government, and state congresses, which led to the emergence of factions in some states. During Saturday's convention, the atmosphere in some areas of the venue, close to the VIP stand, was anything but friendly. Some Imo state delegates engaged in a free-for-all fight two minutes before President Buhari's speech. The fight forced Chairman of Nigerian Governor's Forum, Abdul Aziz Yari, to come to Rochas Okorocha's rescue and took him to VIP stand for peace to reign. Shortly after the president began his speech, another fight broke out at Delta State Delegate seat. Despite effort by army, police, DSS and other security agents, the fight persisted. The Chairman Security Committee of the Convention and Koji State Governor Yahya Bello rushed to intervene and met with the two parties. While speaking to newsmen, Yahya Bello attributed the fight to little misunderstanding, saying efforts are already on to resolve the problem. So it's just a misconception between the Del uh, Delta delegates. So it has been resolved and everything has calmed down. That was a huge misconception. There's another one on the other side. Yeah, he said that misconception is misconception. You know, so we are, we are resolving it. We are resolving it. Well, it's the part of the mis mis uh, mis misconception, and in politics, party politics, you can't rule this one out. But I can assure you, everything is under control. But that doesn't mean the party didn't provide enough security to abat this problem? That's why we are able to quickly put a check to the uh, incident that was about happening. Many ministers who were said not to have control of delegate were seen in Kano delegate seat, sitting with the Minister of Interior, Abdurrahman Dambazaw. Al-Hasambala, ITV News, Abuja.